Get this one. I know. This idea originally came from a game called Forza Horizon 3, and we we kept hopping in this little Lamborghini Aventador, and it looked pretty cool. And so one day I asked my dad, hey, can we build one of those? Kind of thought about it for two or three seconds and then said, yeah, I think we could do that. I was absolutely not sure that I could build a Lamborghini. So that was, I like challenges and it sounded like a pretty difficult challenge. Um, I kind of had an idea in my head on where to start. As a young kid, I worked on engines and cars and I've been a, what we call here a gearhead and um, I've done a lot of mechanics, I've rebuilt engines, I've uh, put cars together, but I've never built anything from scratch. I didn't a priori have knowledge about how to really start other than maybe YouTube University was a good place to go, and so I did watch a lot of videos on chassis building and things of that nature. That's when I came up with the idea of 3D printing because um, about seven years ago, I had, you know, kind of played around with it when I was uh, uh, at my work. And it was kind of cute, you know? I mean, people were making figurines and stuff with it, so that's interesting, right? But it wasn't really kind of industrial. And then I saw, you know, on Amazon, you can just buy these desktop 3D printers and they were getting bigger and bigger. So I decided, let's try it. Obviously, because it's a Lamborghini Aventador look-alike, it's a look-alike, so we modify every single panel. Where this original model came from was a website called Thingiverse, and it was a very detailed, small model of an Aventador. And so what we did is we took that little fall Aventador we threw it into SolidWorks, and then we blew the whole thing up to normal size. And then I like the button to start the car because that, instead of going vroom, vroom, vroom. Particular Lamborghini uh, is about $600,000, depending upon what the options are that you, that you get for it. We have about $18,000 into the project with about a $20,000 budget overall. A lot, a lot about physics, a lot about science. I didn't even know how sturdy this would be or if the inside plastic would potato chip, and that's why we did a little experiment. And yeah, I love this car. I have the coolest dad in the world, not just the world, the whole galaxy, and not just the galaxy, the universe. So I would be lying if I said that, you know, this was just for him. This is for him, for my daughter, and for a lot of other kids out there who are trying to kind of think about what they want to do in life um, and just to kind of show them how cool technology is and what they can do with their, their amazing little minds. I think it looks pretty good. You like it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah.